Colorado truck driver has been indicted after taking children across state lines to engage in sex crimes. This comes after Michael McFadden's state conviction for child molestation was overturned by the State Court of Appeals. CARE X 5's Katerina Krasafis joins me live in studio with more information on how this whole thing unfolded. Kat? Logan, 47 year old McFadden was originally charged with sexual assault of children in state court, where he was convicted by a Mesa County jury. His prison sentence was 324 years to life, but he was ultimately set free due to a speedy trial violation, which meant he could not be retried in state court. Now, this obviously outraged many people in our community, including our district attorney. After McFadden's release, District Attorney Dan Rubenstein contacted the U.S. District Attorney's office and presented them with the case. Seeing the impact this incident had on our community, Rubenstein and the USDA partnered with the FBI to look for any possible federal crimes that could have occurred. This week, McFadden was indicted by a federal grand jury on five counts tied to alleged crimes that happened between 2007 and 2013. At this point, he's presumed innocent and he has a right to have a fair trial in federal court. Uh, and it's my hope that, that that happens and that justice is ultimately served. McFadden, who now lives in Colorado Springs, has been arrested. He was taken to the federal courthouse here in Grand Junction, where he made his initial court appearance Tuesday morning. Now, Steve Lash, who represented McFadden in court, is not his permanent lawyer, but was filling in on the case. And we are currently still waiting to find out who his defense attorney will be. Live in studio, Katerina Krasafis, KREX 5 News.